Boeing has announced plans to reduce its workforce within the Space Launch System, or SLS, program. The company cited changes to NASA's Artemis Moon Exploration Initiative and evolving cost considerations as key factors in the decision. The U.S. aerospace giant expects to eliminate approximately 400 positions as part of its adjusting its role in the program. The SLS program is the backbone of NASA's efforts to return humans to the lunar surface. According to an email seen by Reuters on February 8, 2025, the company confirmed that affected employees would begin receiving 60-day layoff notices in the coming weeks. While Boeing did not specify which roles would be impacted, the job reductions are expected to affect workers directly involved in the production and development of the SLS rocket. We are working with our customer and seeking opportunities to redeploy employees across our company to minimize job losses. The email reads, The layoffs come as NASA continues to revise the timeline and structure of the Artemis program, which aims to send astronauts back to the moon for the first time in over five decades. Initially launched under the U.S. President Trump administration, Artemis has faced escalating costs and delays, with its total budget estimated to reach $93 billion by 2025. As the prime contractor for the SLS program, Boeing has played a key role in developing the Super Heavy Lift rocket designed to carry astronauts and cargo on deep space missions. However, ongoing schedule shifts and budget constraints have led to reassessments of workforce needs. One of the most significant impacts of these delays is the postponement of Artemis II, the first crewed mission in the program. Originally planned for late 2024, the mission, which is supposed to send astronauts on a test flight around the moon, is now scheduled for September 2025. Artemis 3, the mission intended to achieve the first human lunar landing since Apollo 17, has also been delayed, now targeting a September 2026 launch instead of late 2025. These shifts have added pressure to Boeing and other Artemis contractors as NASA refines its strategy for long-term lunar exploration. The delays also raise concerns about broader implications for future space missions, including Artemis IV and subsequent landings, which are intended to lay the foundation for a sustainable human presence on the Moon and eventually Mars. AeroTime is a global, multi-channel, digital, and professional hub, providing news, events, and advisory services to the aviation world. Be sure to subscribe to our newly relaunched YouTube channel and follow us on social media to get the latest aviation news.